So, you know, I was working and I was dope, like one of the best hands down nail techs. So I could get a job anywhere. So I came down here, you know, we're just trying out different places. And I was actually doing nails here. At first, I started doing nails from my, my house. And I'm like, you know, I'm ready to get out here and meet people and things like that. So I started working for different nail companies. And I was doing that for uh, three years. But then I ended up getting really sick. Okay. And um, that kind of put a halt to that. So how my business came about... Um, so two years ago, um, I started like just getting really sick, you know, couldn't breathe. Um, it always just felt like an elephant was like sitting on my chest. And so I would go to the doctor and they was like, well, it looked like you got pneumonia, this and that. Um, fast forward, they ended up diagnosing me with sarcoidosis. Now, sarcoidosis is what Bernie Mac died from mm -hmm. along with pneumonia. But my, my sarcoidosis, my mine was different because all of my organs were shutting down, like my spleen, my liver, my kidney, oh, wow. like all of it was shutting down. Like I was in the hospital so much because they didn't know how to control it. So what they were doing was basically pumping my body with all of these different medications, right? Mm. Which are causing other things to mess up, you know? So after you know, three months, I ended up having to have um, a biopsy because I had got this really, really bad infection to where I couldn't use the bathroom for over 10 days. Like I could not, what? I couldn't have a movement at all. And they were literally coming there every single day doing enemas, giving me all these like cocktails and make me boo boo, nothing for over 10 days. So finally they're like, well, um, they did a biopsy. And they're like, well, if we don't, if you, we can't get you to have a movement, we're going to have to go in and do a surgery. So, okay. Um, I ended up having to have a breast surgery because my, my breast was like kind of smothering my lungs so I couldn't breathe, things like that. So it was like a really like crazy experience. Um, and so after all of that, um, I was, I was uh, prescribed 16 medications a day. Ooh. Not including, um, I was so then I, the medicine uh, turned me into diabetic. So now I'm taking insulin shots along with 16 medications, and, and, along with having a, a, a pick line IV. So I got a, a home care nurse coming to the house five days a week, giving me antibiotics. It's crazy. So as I'm laying in the bed, hospital bed, I'm like, God, I know this is not the way I'm going out. Like, I, I know that I have a purpose. I always knew that like I was, I'm put here for something spectacular, something amazing. I'm not just an average person. And I knew that. And so as I'm praying, God is putting my spirit like, and I'm like, God, I'm ready. Whatever it is that I need to do, let me know I'm ready to do it, right? So I started researching um, holistic living, holistic practices, things like that, herbs, you know, getting into that. So then I started, um, I wanted to detox. So I'm like, okay, as I'm making these juices or making these detoxes, what's the benefits of apples? What's the benefits of this? What's the benefits of that? So I'm writing all this stuff down. So I come home and you get released from the hospital. So now I'm creating all of these juices. I don't know if you remember, like I used to share everything. Like I was very transparent about my journey and sharing it with everybody because you never know who may be going through what you're going through or who you can help or just whatever. I just wanted to share. It's put on my heart to share. So that's how my business came about because once I started juicing and, you know, these things started working for me, I started slowly but surely getting off of medication. I'm getting energy now. So now I want to exercise. My walking turned into jogging jogging turned into running running turned into now i want to kickbox and <laughs> now i want to cycle you know what i'm saying so uh fast forward to a year and a half later i um i went vegan so i'm like plant-based vegan i don't eat any meat i don't do dairy i don't even do impossible burger i'm just strictly like wow plant -based. um i went from 16 medications to zero.
We hustle sun up until sundown Just to keep busy sis In our part of town That's Black 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 It's community wealth When we support ourselves. Recycle the money Before you spend somewhere else That's Black 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 Black